I'm starting with two and a half cups flour, half a cup sugar, half cup shortening, and a half cup butter. But I am using, instead of using shortening, I am replacing with margarine with both butter and the shortening. So I like that buttery taste. Then I'm mixing a teaspoon of salt in, a pinch of baking soda, and then I'm mixing it together. Once it's reached this fine crumbly stage, I'm going to mix a third a cup of ice water. Then I'm going to mix it together until it's all blended. Once it's mixed together, it should look something like this. And now we're going to roll it out and put it in our pan. Now I'm rolling out the crust with wax paper. Once I'm done rolling it out, I'm, I'm going ahead and putting it in the pie tin. Then I'm cutting off the excess pie crust. For the cream filling, I am mixing a cup of sugar and a full bar of cream cheese. Once the sugar and cream cheese are done, I'm gonna put it in the bottom of my pie. Once that's done, it's, it's time to put the filling in. Then it's time to put the crust on the top of it. Once you have the top on your pie, you are gonna put it in the oven at 350 for about a half an hour and checking on it all the time. When it's gotten to the halfway mark of cooking it, I'm just taking a egg wash and I'm, I'm just gonna get it and I'm gonna brush it on top of the pie. You're gonna put it in the oven until the egg wash is completely shiny. Once you're done, this is what the pie looks like. And it's all done, and it's so beautiful. Time to get the pie. 